I would like to take this opportunity to welcome everyone back to yet another video on our channel. I feel like every time I come here, I've got a different problem, the 19-year-old said of traveling to the hospital after her brain tumor diagnosis. Michael Strahan's daughter Isabella Strahan is battling with new symptoms throughout her second round of chemotherapy for her brain tumor. On Wednesday, the 19-year-old student and model released the latest chapter of her YouTube series, where she's been revealing her health journey after undergoing emergency surgery in October 2023 to remove a massive medulloblastoma, a form of cancerous tumor in her cerebellum. In the video, Isabella is in the Duke Children's Hospital and Health Center in Durham, North Carolina undergoing her second round of chemotherapy. As a nurse inserts the chemo port in her upper stomach, she said she's become used to all the preparation for treatment. I feel like if you told me I'd be doing this back in the summer, I'd be like, shush, I hate needles, what? This is my worst dread. I detest needles, she said, but I guess I got used to them. Isabella then said that sadly, each trip to the hospital she's dealing with new problems. I feel like every time I come here, I've got a different problem. Last time it was my head, she said, referring to the pain she was in resulting in her second craniotomy. Now I literally can't walk without being lightheaded or out of breath. These are completely opposite of symptoms, she remarked. At least when I wanted to cut off my head, I could take pain medicine. Now I can't take anti-exhaustion medication or something. Staying optimistic, Isabella highlighted some changes she's made. Before, she coped with a lot of sickness, recalling a period when she went to Chick-fil-A and couldn't eat anything. Now, she says she's in the mood for food and is eating two full meals a day. The video then shows Isabella preparing for one of her chemotherapy medications to be delivered, sitting in her hospital room with her hands and feet buried in buckets of ice. We're icing my feet. It helps avoid neuropathy since vincristine, one of the chemo medications I get. That's a side effect, she explained. We've got the chemo bags of ice, so I'm going to stick my hands in here for a while. Some forms of chemotherapy medications can produce peripheral neuropathy, which is a group of symptoms caused by damage to nerves that govern the feelings and movements of our arms, legs, hands, and feet, according to the American Cancer Society. Cold treatment, administering ice to the hands and feet, is commonly done to assist patients lessen peripheral neuropathy. In another video this week, Isabella's twin sister Sophia joined her while getting cold treatment for chemo. She released a clip showing her naked feet and hands in buckets of ice while Sophie teased, this is what the world wants to see.